Whale barnacles are usually found on baleen whales, so like filter feeding whales like the right whale, gray whale, and humpback whale. And barnacles are crustaceans related to lobsters, crabs, and shrimps. But unlike their relatives, barnacles are sessile as adults, which means they don't have any ability to move around. They look like horrible parasites and do embed themselves deep in the whale's skin, but most scientists actually seem to think that they're commensal. Commensalism is a type of interaction where one species benefits from the interaction, but the other isn't really affected positive or negative about it. The barnacles get a safe space to filter feed on whale in plankton-rich water, and the whales don't really seem to suffer any negative consequences. Some humpbacks have been found with just shy of a thousand pounds of barnacles on them and seem to be doing just fine. So what's crazy is a thousand pounds of barnacles on a 55 to 66 thousand pound animal would be like me, who's probably like a 200 pounder, having about three pounds of clothes on me. But the coolest part of whale barnacles, in my opinion, is that some whales might use them for weapons and armor. When getting attacked by orcas, some whales, like gray whales, have been seen tipping on their side to let the orca get a bite of a hard and mobile barnacle instead of getting a chunk out of them. Or it's also possible that barnacles could be used as a strike damage buff in mating battles. So at best, whale barnacles could have a slight positive impact, but at worst they're probably a minor annoyance.